If you want to know the best science fiction TV shows, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of 2021. He's wondering if you might confirm your response to questions four and five in review of Orgasm 3248. We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good TV show again. Number 10. Hey, yeah, weißt du, was das war? Tribes of Europa is a German science fiction television series created by Philip Koch. Catastrophe has already happened and the world is ruined, ravaged and split. As a global event causes Europe to crash down and be torn apart into microstates, these tribes find themselves in constant war for dominance and resources. Caught up in the middle are three siblings with the one goal of survival. But when they stumble upon a mysterious cube, their fates get intertwined in the everlasting war of the tribes. Nichts in die Richtung. So was gab's noch nicht vor dem schwarzen Dezember. Das ist von danach. Ein Grund mehr, sich anzuschauen. Number nine. I know you're not the architect of this plot, but you are the face of it. The face that broke my son's heart. Foundation is a science fiction television series created by David S. Goyer and Josh Friedman. Loosely based on the infamous story by legendary author Isaac Asimov, Foundation chronicles the thousand-year saga of the Foundation, a band of exiles that makes a terrifying discovery. The known galactic empire will crash down and collapse as they know it, and their only way to be safe is to build a new civilization. With striking visuals and a lore to be discovered, we ask us, can the empire offset the disaster before it begins? And it's the reason the empire will take us. They're worried you can predict the future. They're worried people believe I can, and they don't like the future I predict. Which is what? Trantor is going to be destroyed. The Empire will fall. Number 8. Hi. What's your name? Doctor Eleven. Station Eleven is a post-apocalyptic science fiction miniseries created by Patrick Somerville. Set in a dystopian future where a flu pandemic has destroyed civilization as we once knew it, Station Eleven follows a small group of survivors who make their living as traveling performers on the road. But as they encounter a group much darker and more violent than they are, they get tangled up in the games of a cult with mysterious plans and a horrifying past. He said you'd come. He invited you to join the undersea. They won't use chloroform if you know it. A prophecy. Number 7. They must really like your candy, too. What did you just say? Those men. They have lots of your candy in those boxes. Sweet Tooth is a fantasy drama television series created by Jim Mickle, bringing fresh air to the post-apocalyptic genre with creative ideas and effective tropes. This lonesome adventure is set in a world where a mysterious virus has wiped out most of humanity. But not only that, it caused the birth of part human, part animal babies that are now hunted by society and blamed as the cause of the world's crumble. Now young Gus, half deer, must survive in the wilderness without help. They smell like wet moccasins and old raisins. What does? Your candy. You can smell my pills from there? Well, actually, I could smell them from outside. Number 6. Watashi, yoku shitteru no Anetto no osana nasumi no koto. Datte. 86 is a mecha sci-fi anime series created by Toshimasa Ishii and Asato Asato. The world is at war as the Republicans fight an empire. After tremendous losses due to the empire's advanced mecha technology, the Republic finally developed their own mecha robots called Juggernauts. But what no one knows is that the robots are secretly suits piloted by soldiers. Now a brutal war where oil and blood will clash will escalate, and the future of humanity is about to be determined. Number 5 The Empire does not tolerate failure, Sergeant. There were complications. Star Wars The Bad Batch is an animated action television series created by Dave Filoni. Inviting fans to a story that begins right in the middle of Order 66, we follow the gritty and twisted storytelling of past Clone Wars seasons, and this show introduces new characters. 
genetically modified clone troops that have devoted their lives to a special mission with individual style and personalities. But as the dark forces take over and clones become killer machines, they find themselves in the eye of the storm. I warned you not to come back. Had to. We were looking for you. Me? What do you say, kid? You want to come with us? Or did we get captured for nothing? Number four. Tell people I am an alien. Climb to the highest tower in town and shout it to everyone. Resident Alien is a science fiction mystery comedy drama television series created by Chris Sheridan. Yes, aliens have moral dilemmas too. In this comedic approach to alien invasion tropes, we go to the hilarious absurd. Crash landing on Earth with the mission to destroy humanity, alien Harry takes on the identity of a small-town doctor. Asked to perform an autopsy on a man that died of unknown circumstances, he starts to struggle with his mission as a nine-year-old boy sees him in his real form. You're so stupid. Hi, I'm an alien, and I think it's castle times and there are towers. I was testing to see if you thought there were towers, and you're lucky you passed. Number three. Mouse is a South Korean thriller television series created by TVN and Jenny Choi. Embarking on a game of cat and mouse, a young and overly ambitious police officer and veteran detective with a traumatizing past need to find a serial killer who has an entire nation holding its breath. But as their encounter with the horrifying deeds becomes more and more personal, their lives change forever as a road with no return unfolds. Number 2 Vivi, Florite's Eye Song is a sci-fi anime series created by Tapae Nagatsuki and Eji Umehara. The future is bright with hyper-intelligent AI flawlessly mimicking human appearance to serve one specific man-made mission. In the case of Vivi, it is to make people happy with her music. But when a mysterious AI claims to be from 100 years in the future, when Earth is destroyed by a horrifying war, Vivi begins her century-long journey to save humanity. Vivi. Before we unveil TV show number one, here are some honorable mentions. Your lightsaber blade is red! Coward! Unfortunately, I am not a Jedi. Pure union. Hazel and I are users one. Tomorrow, friends, Hazel and I will get our chips implanted. <laughs> yeah, two Number one. Jabba had many vessels. We've got a lot of ground to cover if we are to keep his empire intact. The Book of Boba Fett is a science fiction action adventure television series created by John Favreau and Dave Filoni. The legendary bounty hunter is back from the dead, and he is angry. Navigating the underworld of the galaxy with mercenary Fennec Shand, they return to the sands of Tatooine and stake their claim on the territory formerly ruled by the deceased crime lord, Jabba the Hutt. Building upon the instant iconic hit, The Mandalorian, this space tale expands on the Star Wars universe with more gritty and dirty action. Jabba ruled with fear. I intend to rule with respect. If I may. Speak freely. In difficult times, fear is a sure bet. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.